Alrighty, so I was passing by and I saw this place. It said discount groceries save 30, was that supposed to be 30 to 80%? So I figured why not give it a go and let's see what they got. MVP squad welcome back to another video so a girl is running on fumes I slept like an hour <laughs> an hour and it's now 1 24 in the afternoon I worked last night but anyways Brielle is in the Christmas parade today so I had to drop her off to school like really really early and I guess I'm gonna go this way Anyways, I dropped her off to school really, really early, and then um, I decided, after I dropped her off, to do some couponing, because I went in my she shed um, to get um, like Christmas stuff out, and y'all, a girl stockpile was like, not, stop, not stockpiling it at all. It was looking bad. I, had, I could see space. I don't like to see space. Okay, so I decided to do some couponing today, and I did not normally I write it in my couponing planner and I plan it all out. This was on a whim. So I stopped to a Dollar General that I normally like I hate. They are just you can't get down the aisles, there's boxes, it's clutter, it's just ghetto fabulous. It's bad. It's just terrible. They need to shut it down and build a new one. That's just how bad it is. There's no fixing it. So, anyways, I um did I stopped there um I did one transaction it turned out good but it took me so long in the store probably like almost an hour because they had nothing everything that I sat in my car and clip coupons for most of them they didn't have my main thing I'm low on is toilet paper and paper towels and so there wasn't very good coupons for that this week but I made it work um and then I went to down the street from there, maybe about two miles from there. I went to a Family Dollar. It's not; these are not the stores I normally go to. These are over by Brielle School. So I went to a Family Dollar. I did two transactions there. <clears throat> they weren't bad, but like they had some good coupons, but nothing was attaching. They updated their app, and I don't like the update. Updates horrible. So, um, yeah, they need to quit it. Stop updating stuff. Excuse me. But anyways, that was horrible. So, I did get the two transactions. And um, so, for my total of my three transactions, um, one at Dollar General and two at Family Dollar, I spent $36. So, I'm going to show you guys what I got. And y'all let me know how I did. Um, come on, car. So, um, yeah, then I went to that discount store, um, you know, I went to the discount store and I had never been there, so I decided to see what it was about. I was pleasantly pleased. They do sell some out-of-date stuff that's really cheap, um, like their bread was really soft, but it was out-of-date. I'm big on kind of dates and stuff unless it's something that I have bought when it was like in a good day and then I like froze it or something like that or certain canned goods I bought myself and then I knew they like I don't even think I've ever had any canned goods that expired because I used my stuff uh, but anyways everything I bought was still in date I changed the dates on everything I didn't buy anything that was expired but I think I did really good um, when you use a card at that store, they do charge you 3%. Um, it's better to have cash, but I didn't have cash, but that was okay. I think my 3% only came to like 70 cents, um, or whatever. I think is what she told me. I don't know. I didn't do the math. But, um, anyways, I was very, very pleased with the things I got for the price I got. So, um, 
my total I think was twenty four seventy at that store. Twenty four sixty. I think it was twenty four sixty. So wait till I show you. I'll show you guys everything when I get home. All my transactions, all that good jazz. Okie dokie. I see y'all when okay, I get to guys. So I have made it back home. We're gonna quickly go over the things that I got. I got everything together. First haul was Dollar General. Okay, so first thing I got was Tide um, Spring Pods. What is this? Spring Meadow 16 pack. It was $5.50 and I had a dollar fifty off coupon. Okay, next was the Colgate Optic White Toothpaste. This was four dollars. And I had a two fifty off coupon. Alrighty. Um, after that, we have the Skin to Mint uh, razors. This is a four pack. This was six fifty, and I had a four dollar off coupon. Next, we have uh, Cottonelle um, toilet paper. This was five fifty. This cotton nail is a uh, four mega rolls, which equals 16 rolls. This was $5.50, and I had a $2 off coupon. After that, we had the Chic Classic Razors. This was $5.35, and um, I had a $3 off coupon. And the last thing in this order was Angel Soft. It's a four pack, but it equals 16 rolls because they're like mega rolls. This was $3.95 and I had a dollar off coupon. Today is Saturday. You save five off when you spend $25. So the total was $12.61, but that was including tax. So um, I will list the non-tax total up here because my tax will be different than your tax um, where you live. And that was Dollar General. Okay, next I had two transactions at Family Dollar. The first transaction um would be this right here so we had the angel uh soft bath tissue this right here this is the linen scent it's the scented tube this is an eight pack but it equals 32 rolls because these are the mega rolls okay that was 5.95 and i had a dollar off coupon then we have another cotton nail uh four pack this was 5.25 it equals mega rolls, 16 mega rolls. This was $5.25. I had a $2 off coupon. Then next we had Colgate Optic White Stain Fighter Toothpaste. This was $4.35. Then I had a $2.50 off coupon. And then I had Gain Light Moon um, Gain Flings Moonlight Breeze. This is a 31 count. This here was $9.95 and I had a $3 off coupon. That makes this transaction $12 because it was five off when you spend $25. So I said $12 for those items. Okay, uh, my last transaction at Family Dollar was the another um, eight mega roll toilet paper. I got the linen, fresh linen scent again. It was $5.95, I had a dollar off coupon. Okay, then next I needed some filler items because they didn't have any of the other stuff I wanted. So I got two of the pepper stir fry. This is yellow onion, red, yellow, green bell peppers. I usually get this at Dollar Tree, which you guys already know Dollar Tree and Family Dollar are owned by the same company. These were $1.25 and I got two of them. They are like leaking because they're thawing out. I'm going to get it in the freezer. Then I have... Um, Tide Pods Light Ocean Scent. This is a 42 pack of um, the Tide Pods. This was $13.25 and I had a $5 off coupon. Great deal. The next I had uh, Palmolive. This is Palmolive Re-Energizing um, Green Apple and White Lily Scent. It smells so good. Um, and this here is 20 ounces. This was $3 and I had a $1.50 off coupon. And then last but not least is Suavitel Morning Sun 18 um, count dryer sheets. This was only $1 and this is because I need a filler item because my total was like $24 and some change. And you got to get that 25 threshold 
um, in order for all your coupons to come off, as well as for that five off of 25. So this total came to 1320 before tax. Okay. Then um, you guys saw that I went to that discount store um, that I was telling you about. Everything that I got was in date, and I think I got some really good deals for the amount of money I spent. I spent twenty four dollars and sixty cents. That was including a seventy cent um, upcharge because I used my debit card. Okay, so I got the lady ripped this when she was. They're not open, but she ripped it when she was trying to put it in the bag because she's trying to shove too much stuff in one bag. But this is like the Fruity Pebbles. It's the Fruity Dino Bites. I buy these from Walmart <clears throat> multiple times. This bag was 30, it's 32 ounces. It was $2. And it does not expire until June of 2024. Great deal. $2 for that. So I bought two of them because Brielle loves this cereal. Okay. Then the next thing I got was Brielle some Pringles. It's the pizza um, Pringles. This is the big can. This was one dollar and this does not expire until April of 2024. So within the date. Then I got this for me some uh, Fritos flavored twist the honey barbecue. This bag has a retail price on it of $5.69. Y'all may not be able to see it. I'll try to zoom in. But I got it for two dollars. And these does not expire until January 30th of 2024. Okay. Then I got a box. As you can tell. You guys already know my kids love cereal. I love cereal. Uh, cinnamon Toast Crunch. This um, box of Cinnamon Toast Crunch was 2 bucks, And it does not expire until August of 2024. And then. I love this cereal. So does my husband. Honey Smacks. Um. This pretty decent sized box was two bucks and it does not expire until June 3rd of 2024. Okay, and then I got, um, because it's going around flu, COVID, all the things. So I got two, of, they were the CVS brand, um, COVID 19 test kits, uh, rapid results, results in 10 minutes. There's two in each box. These were only a dollar. I bought two of them. Um, and they expire, the test said they expire in June of 2024. So, I got like six months, you know, in case somebody gets sick and need a test. And that was two bucks for four tests. And these tests be expensive now in the stores. I ain't paying no like $20 for a COVID test. Negative. So, I love it. These store, okay. And this, to me, was the best deal. Um... I'm missing something. Oh, what the lady do with my stuff? Why is everything always missing something? I'm missing some candy. Not M&M's. I have to find them. Anyways, I bought two packs of M&M's. They were uh, 25 cents a pack. And um, I don't see where they're at. So, I don't know about that. No, nope, that's my little tree cakes. I don't know. But anyways, this is what I first saw. They had these in a cart outside. They were unloading their like trailer of new stuff they got in. And this is the Oral-B Vitality Rechargeable Toothbrush. Deep clean between teeth. Um, It has a built-in timer on it, I saw. for So you can brush for the recommended two minutes. Uh, waterproof handle. Round brush head. Long-lasting battery. These were five dollars. Five dollars. Exact same toothbrush in Publix for twenty-seven dollars. I thought that was a steal. So of course I got two. I got one for me and one for my hubby. And that is it, because I don't know where my M&Ms are. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, if you like my coupon and hauls, give this video a big old thumbs up. I tried to teach you guys how to live exceptionally well on an extreme budget. A girl loves to coupon. I love very much so love the coupon. I'm always looking for a deal. We do a lot of traveling, going places, and I always do it for a very, very reasonable price. Listen, because that's how I live my life. So if you have not joined the MVP squad, then join so that you can learn all these tricks and stuff and save yourself some money. Because what I say, save your coins. Listen, don't nobody eat nothing for free in this life, so you might as well save as much as you can. 
But anyways, I'm always out there looking for a deal. Um, that's how I get most of my Christmas. And then I also get money back through racketing. Uh, racketing gives you money back at like thousands of stores when you shop online. They also have some deals for in-store deals to get cash back. Um, I have a link. It's always down in my description box if you've never joined. And they give you $40 back off your first purchase. Um, but anyways, uh, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please give it a big old thumbs up. And a girl is about to put this stuff away and move on to the next thing with my hour of sleep. But I'll catch y'all in the next one. Bye, everyone. I learned